Hey guys, it's your boy Climax, and today we're going to be talking about can the Washington football team win a playoff game? Now, right now, uh, the Washington uh, football team, I, I might make the mistake calling them the Redskins this video. Please, you know, just stick with me. Uh, can they win a playoff game? Right now, they are looking uh, to be playing, because uh, obviously they will be, you know, the, the worst um, division winning team in the NFL, I mean, I think we all know why that is. They're <laughs> they might not even get 500 and win that division. So I mean, that division is just that bad. It's the NFC least for a reason. So uh, right now they are, you know, ranked to play the Bucks, uh, probably or the Rams. Now one of these matchups is better than the other, and I will kind of break it down for you guys and tell you why that is. Uh, Tom Brady's stats are looking pretty good, but this is a video about the football team. So, the football team has one big strength, and that strength would be uh, their defense, and especially their defensive line, but uh, in general, their defense is definitely their strength. And to be more specific, their pass defense is the strength. They are third uh, in pass yards allowed. So their passing defense is w one of the best, and that that goes along with them being uh, very good in sacks. They are sixth in the NFL in sacks, uh, and they're like tied for the sixth, so really they're like sixth or f sixth and fifth are like tied or something like that. So um, they could be sixth or fifth in the NFL in sacks if uh, that makes you change your mind on how good this defense is. But they are very good against the pass, especially, and that really plays against the Buccaneers because the Buccaneers are good at passing, but not very good at running. The Buccaneers are 28th in the NFL in running. So, I, I mean, and the Redskins, are, I mean, <laughs> the football team is, like, decent against the run, too. So, if the football team doesn't have to worry about you know, the run game, they're going to be even better against the pass, they're going to be able to get to Tom Brady, and it's not going to be a good day for the Buccaneers, but uh, the Washington football team uh, is fifth in total defensive yards allowed, uh, six in sacks, like I said, with 40, and, ooh, that guy shot an interception, but, um, and they are third in passing yards allowed per game on defense, so they are very good in those, those statistical categories. And their biggest weakness on defense is uh, defense against the run. And of course, like I said, the Bucks are 28th in the run, and the Rams are 9th in rushing yards per game. So, obviously, it would probably be better if the um, Redskins played the you know the Buccaneers um, because their their defense is more suited and probably has a better chance of stopping the Buccaneers than they do the Rams. Now. That also has to do um, with the Rams also have like the best defense in the NFL, and um, the Bucks definitely do not have the best defense. Now the Bucks defense is good, and they probably will be able to you know really shut probably um, hold the football team to very few yards. But it is nothing like the Rams. The Rams have Aaron Donald, Jalen Ramsey, and just really really big big name big players that really will be able to shut down the football team. Well, you know, the Buccaneers have good players, but will they be able to shut down this team? I mean, a team led by Alex Smith who has playoff experience like that? I, I don't know. I mean, maybe Alex Smith can can really, you know, get in there and um, get get in the playoffs, get back into playoff mode and, and do very good for this football team. But uh, we will have to see, hopefully... Hopefully, I mean, I think it would be very cool to see this this football team, um, the Washington football team to be specific, to get into the playoffs, uh, win a game, and not make this division look so bad. Because, like, I mean, if, if they can win a game, and I believe they, they if they played the Buccaneers, they definitely could win a game, um, then, again, this division would not look so bad. Yes, the records would still be bad, but... Um, you know they would they would have won a, a game in the playoffs and you know they would be really looking up up for next year and hopefully be able to actually win some games in the regular season next year and not have to you know just hope and pray that this division sucks again but yeah i think the washington football team could win a playoff game if they were up against the bucks and because of those 
those stats that I read now. The the offense for this team is not good. It would have to be a low scoring game and they would really, really have to, you know, shut down Tom Brady. Uh really hope for turnovers. I mean They'd have to get a lot of turnovers from Brady, in which I think Brady is capable of of, do, of making those mistakes, especially with his age, uh, making some errant th- errant throws that could turn into turnovers and interceptions, and you know big interceptions for this team, the uh, the Washington Football Team. If that were to ever happen, now, um, yeah, it would be would be interesting to see how the Bucks would handle the Reds, uh, the Washington football team's pressure. I don't think they would do so good at it, but uh, we would have to see. I don't know if this um, offense could, if the Washington offense could really move the ball effectively on this Bucks defense, especially if not uh, Dwayne Haskins throwing Aaron passes like that, but I'm I'm pretty sure uh, their starting quarterback would be a man named Alex Smith. So you know, it'll be interesting to see what um the football team does in the next couple of weeks to see if you know they can they can get some offense going and really really improve on that. And we'll see how the Buccaneers finish out the year. They absolutely blew out the Lions. Uh, but it, it is the Lions, and that's kind of the way the Buccaneers have been playing. They've been playing decent one week, um, losing the next, or, the, you know, they, they lose one week, and then they blow out the next week, um, and they usually lose the week against the good team and blow out the bad team, so who really, really knows? I mean, and I mean that could play good for the Bucs because the, the Washington team isn't a good team, so they might blow them out, but you also have that scary chance of maybe, um, maybe, this Washington team, you know, sends Tom Brady home in the first round again uh, for the second year in a row. Now, I think uh, if you're looking at as the Buccaneers standard, that would definitely be a fail of a season. Now, for the Washington football team, if they won a playoff game, that would definitely be a win for this season. I think that would be more than what they were expecting. Um, granted, the division is less than what they were expecting, but, you know, hey, uh, this team... You could say it kind of deserved the playoff spot because it won the division, and you know they this team isn't as bad as as some people would say they are. I mean they're a decent team. They're kind of scary because they have that good defense, and with a good defense, you're always kind of can be in the game, uh, especially with Alex Smith, who can you know can be a decent quarterback and probably probably really really would be will be really good for this team. And the fact that, you know, he's been in the playoffs. He he knows the gist of those things. I mean, they have a good receiver in Scary Terry. I mean, their running back is all right. He plays amazing against the Cowboys if he's still healthy. I think he kind of got hurt there. But, um, yeah, we will have to see. Guys, uh, tell me what you think. If you think the Washington football team could have beat uh, the Bucks or the Rams if they will make a playoff game or if I'm just, you know, uh, saying some stupid stuff right now. Tell me what you think and, you know, the the realistic chance that the football team could actually win a game in the playoffs, given their status with their record and all. So, guys, hope you did enjoy. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe. Really, really greatly appreciate that if you would do that. Uh, if you did like it, of course. If you didn't, you know, uh, you didn't like it, and that's all right, too. Uh, but, yeah, I hope you did enjoy. hope you guys have a great, 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 great day, and I will catch you all in the next one, hopefully. Peace.